Yo, what's up guys, it's X-Rays, and welcome to my second Call of Duty Ghost Weapon comparison video. In today's video, we're going to be covering the two fastest firing SMGs in Call of Duty Ghost. We're going to be talking about the PP-19 Bison, and of course, the Vepr. Really quickly before I jump into the video, if you guys are new and have not already subscribed and you enjoy these kinds of videos, feel free to do so. I'm on my way to 30,000 subscribers, so any help you guys could give me would be much appreciated. Now with that being said, let's jump into today's weapon comparison video. Let's start with the PP-19 Bison. The PP-19 Bison has a magazine size of 36 rounds per magazine. It's a little bit above average from normal SMGs, which is a good thing because it fires really quickly. The Bison actually does 42 damage up close and drops down to 17. It actually is the steepest drop off in damage, but it actually is not that bad when compared to other SMGs. It's about three hit points less than most of the other SMGs, which is okay when you take into consideration the amount of damage it does up close. Because it does have this really steep drop off, the Bison is actually a 3 to 6 shot kill weapon. This means that you are constantly going to be finding yourself getting a lot of hit markers and wasting a lot of ammo if you're at its maximum distance. Now to compensate for this, the Bison actually has a 1.5 time headshot multiplier which is really effective when added to its 42 damage. We're going to talk about this a little bit more further. The Bison has a firing rate of 937 rounds per minute. It's actually one of the fastest firing SMGs in Call of Duty Ghost. Because it has such a high rate of fire, it actually has medium to high recoil. It's a kind of weapon where you're definitely going to want to keep it up close because it does a max damage and the recoil is a lot more manageable. If you have to go into a gunfight that is a little bit more at a distance, I would suggest burst firing since it's a lot easier to control that kind of recoil than trying to pull down on the trigger and hope that it kills the other person. Now that we've talked about the PP-19 Bison, let's go ahead and move on over to the Vepr. The Vepr actually has a huge magazine size of 42 rounds per magazine. It's the kind of weapon where you don't have to constantly be thinking of having to reload since you're more than likely going to have enough ammo in the magazine to be able to take out the enemy. The Vepr does 35 damage up close but drops down to 25 at a distance. Once again, the moral of the story, it's an SMG, keep it up close and you're going to be doing a ton of work. Because its drop off isn't as bad as some of the other SMGs, it's still a very consistent weapon even at a max distance, making this weapon a 3 to 5 shot kill weapon. When you add the 1.5 time headshot multiplier, you're able to cut down the 3 to 5 shot kill range down to a 2 to 4 shot kill range. The Vepr fires at 869 rounds per minute, which is faster than some of the SMGs that are in Call of Duty Ghost. Because it does fire a little bit faster than some of the other ones, you will experience a bit more recoil with it, having medium to high recoil. Alright guys, so now that we have the stats on both of these weapons, I want you guys to personally leave a comment down below. Tell me which one you prefer. Maybe you just like one over than the other. Maybe you statistically think that one is better than the other. Leave a comment. I want to see how many of you guys enjoy the Vepr, or maybe you like the uh, Bison a little more than the other. Leave a comment. It'll be pretty interesting to see some of that, and of course, I'll reply to some of those. Now, with that being said, the better SMG in this comparison is actually going to be the PP-19 Bison. The reason that the Bison is a little bit better is just because of the fact that it has a more more effective headshot multiplier. When I was looking at the stats of both of these weapons, I found that they were very similar, with the only exception really being the fact that the Bison has a more effective headshot multiplier. When you add the 1.5 headshot multiplier, you're able to make it so that if you get at least one headshot in your burst, you're going to be able to get the kill. Now even though the Vepr also has a 1.5 headshot multiplier, you have to get two headshots in order to get the kill, while with the Bison you're able to get one shot on the chest and another shot on the head to get the kill, making it a much better weapon to use up close. That with the combination of it being a faster firing weapon makes the Bison a deadly SMG when used for its purpose being up close. Anyways guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Call of Duty Ghost Weapon Comparison. If you did, remember to slap a like and a favorite on this video. And if you guys are new and you enjoy these types of videos, then feel free to subscribe. I'm on my way to 30,000 subscribers, so any help you guys would give me would be much appreciated. Now, with that being said, if you guys have any suggestions for the next weapon comparison, leave them down below as a comment. Feel free to leave any weapon from any class that you want, and you might see it in a future video. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys next time. I'm Xperia, I'm out. Peace.